shortly after the recent update, some owners reported that they can no longer send picture messages or MMS. While it may seem like a problem caused by the latest update, more often than not, it's actually just a minor problem that occurs every now and then. Hey guys, in this video, I will show you what to do if your iPhone can't send MMS after the iOS 14 update. First solution, make sure cellular data is enabled. When it comes to sending and receiving MMS, you need your device to have a connection via cellular data. That should be the first thing you have to check. From the home screen, tap the settings icon. Tap cellular. Now tap the switch next to cellular data to enable it. If it's already enabled, leave it as it is and then try to check if you can now send an MMS. Second solution, force restart your iPhone. If it's not due to a disabled cellular data, it's possible that the problem is caused by a minor system glitch. That's the reason why you need to perform the forced restart as the next solution. Quickly press and release the volume up and then the volume down button. Immediately after that, press and hold the power key for 10 seconds. This will trigger your iPhone to power off and turn back up. Once the logo shows, release the power key and wait until it has finished restarting. When the reboot is finished, try to check if the problem is fixed. Third solution, reset the network settings. If the first and second solutions failed to fix the problem, what you have to do next is to reset the network services. You can do so by resetting the network settings. Here's how it's done. From the home screen, tap settings. Tap general. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch reset. Touch reset network settings. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap reset network settings at the bottom of the screen. Your iPhone will reboot after this. Once it has finished rebooting, try to see if the problem is fixed. Fourth solution, factory reset your iPhone. A reset will be able to fix network issues including this problem, but make sure to create a backup of your important files and data because they will be deleted and you may not be able to retrieve them. When ready, follow these steps. From the home screen, tap settings. Find and tap general. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch reset. Tap erase all contents and settings. Tap erase now. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap erase iPhone at the bottom of the screen. Tap erase iPhone again to proceed. Now enter your Apple ID password, and then tap erase to proceed with the reset. Wait until your iPhone has finished the reset, and then set it up as a new device. I hope that this simple troubleshooting guide has been helpful. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.